Hey everybody, today I want to show you a new project, a remote controllable IKEA table. I actually started this project a couple of months ago with a friend of mine, uh, Ilya. We had the idea of replicating a scene from a Dutch or international TV series called Neighbor and Neighbor. In the video, Neighbor and Neighbor work together to try to put everything in their house on wheels and they can even remote control it. That of course ends in chaos, but I thought it would be cool to try to replicate it. So yeah, here it is. It is remote controllable with this joystick. In this video, I will quickly give you an overview of what the table can do, how it's built, and I will also show how you can use it to deliver a drink if you're sitting on the couch, just relaxing. Um, but let me start off by showing what it's made of by tilting the table. So here we see the inside of the robotic table. As you can see, the base is just a simple IKEA lock table. You can buy it for six euros, which I think makes it the most affordable robot frame which you can buy on the market. Um, I, of course, attached swing wheels to it. Um, which are a bit higher because these wheels need a bit more space. I attached some motors to the base of these legs. Um, they are geared motors, so they have a bit more power and the table doesn't go that fast. Uh, double wheels, so they have a bit of extra grip on the floor, maybe outside, I don't know, as soon as I will try it. Um, and I 3D printed something which uh, nicely embeds these motors into the legs of the table. Uh, I'll share the design online. To actually make it remote controllable, you need a joystick and of course a receiver for the signal, uh, a 12 volt battery to power everything and to power the motors, uh, power the receiver. Um, and then of course you have the uh, ESCs, which translate the signal into the right current to make the motors spin as fast as you want them to spin. One thing which you can also see is that I already put an Arduino here. And the Arduino will hopefully help me make the table completely autonomous instead of only remotely controlled. So if you're interested in seeing the first autonomous driving table, make sure to subscribe to my channel so you can see the next update. Hopefully I can put the robot operating system on the table um, and we can have some fun to make it autonomous and maybe map the room. I don't know. Let's see. Thank you. 